Style channel. As you can tell, we're not in Orange County. We're up in Los Angeles, and I am bringing you in to a magical world of vintage here in LA called the Kit Vintage. It's the kickoff to the holiday season, and I thought the best way to bring us into the glittery gold goodness of the holidays would be to have a full on dress up party at the Kit Vintage. Robin, the owner, has curated this magical collection of the most dreamy dresses, jewelry, fringe, fur, all the drippings and drapings, and we're just going to have a full-on holiday Cinderella moment. I'm going to try on a bunch of the amazing dresses, show you all of them, and then we're gonna style up some holiday fun here at the Kid Vintage. But first, let's go inside the store, meet Robin, get a little bit of a tour, and then we'll play dress up. And first of all, thank you for having me here. This is so much fun. Thank you for being here. It's even more fun for me. This is like, honestly, it's very Art Deco, which I love. Yes. And it has a very boudoir, dressing room, yeah. cozy, but also fabulous and you, very... Oh, yeah. go ahead. No, I was going to say, you kind of picked up exactly oh, on my design. Oh, yay. Just yay. by saying that. Like, that's what I had envisioned when I was designing the store. So thank you for... Noticing. For feeling that, yeah. <laughs> And I love it because we're focusing on, you know, holiday dressing and I feel like your store is like the perfect to just kick off the holidays with because it's all just magic in here. Thank you. It's amazing. <laughs> so before we jump into actually seeing all of the goodness here at the store, can you tell me a little bit about how did you start the Kid Vintage? How did you end up here? So, I want to make a long story short. Okay. So, my husband has been in the business. He sells antique, vintage, fine jewelry. Yes. So, I have been in fashion for about 20 years. I've been a vintage collector myself yes. for, for 30 right. years. For, for as long, long as you knew what clothes were. Yes, right. exactly. Right. I, was, I was collecting, you know, vintage Levi's, oh, you know, yeah. starting when I was a teenager. Yeah. Anyways, so, um, I had been in fashion, but I really just got to the point where I was like, I just want to deal in vintage. That's mm -hmm. really my love, my passion, that's where I want to be. And my husband had a store, and so he was like, well, why don't you just start off with a wrap? Yeah. And that's how I started. So I was still doing my styling on the side, but I wanted to kind of get a feeler of, you know, how would people take it if I start curating a collection? And it really matched up and correlated with my husband's store because he has amazing fine antique jewelry. And so I wanted to have really special occasion and Ooh, dresses yeah. and bridal because he has a lot of beautiful, amazing engagement rings. So we thought that if we had the correlation of this beautiful fine jewelry and these beautiful gowns and dresses, that people can kind of mix and match yeah. and between the two of us. So that's, that's so really great. You had like a perfect little launch pad, I feel like, with that. I'm very lucky with yeah, that. Thank you. So nice. <laughs> and then you do have such a beautiful collection. It is a lot of the special pieces and the what I call always play dress up pieces. Just that <laughs> idea, I think, what is so much fun with clothes and with vintage in particular is it every piece feels like you're escaping into something like you're yes. escaping into another reality you're putting on I like to almost feel like every day's a stage and you're gonna just <laughs> yeah. create a new character every I'm day. envisioning this whole thing yes. while I'm just driving yes. I feel like we're on the stage right now <laughs> yes. Yes. Um, but I feel like you have so much of that and when you are curating and collecting what do you love to bring in your shop what are the things that really speak to you yeah. and that you love so I do everything I buy I do love okay so I have to start, kind of start off with that because even if it's something that I appreciate but it's not necessarily my passion I usually leave it to the side so I kind of cherry pick all the pieces okay. that I have in the store it's really important to me yeah um, so what do I love Lame, <laughs> metallics yes. gold um, rhinestones sequins like all the showy pieces yes really what I'm attracted to so like if I'm looking at a gown with any kind of lame or any kind of sparkle to it I am like 
right away like attracted to it and it kind of goes full force. Anything ornamented is yeah. really are pieces that I really, really love. But mm -hmm. then, you know, and you know, kind of give it to like a you know a broader scale. Um, I'm uh, you know then I started getting sets and yeah. separates. So not only was I getting ornamented dresses, but then I would pick you know blouses and blazers and separate pieces that people could wear just on a daily basis, not necessarily just going to like a special occasion. Right, right. Um, and then bridal. Bridal has always been really important and a big focus of mine. So I collect a lot of whites for that alternative bride who might not want the traditional wedding dress and something different. And well, I feel like too, if you do want the traditional wedding dress, think about the reception and then yes. that's like your party dress yes. and your like dance all night. So I just feel like I feel like every bride should just be wearing it. Anyway, it's like you yeah. have all these amazing things to choose from, and and, and it's and it's your it's a special day for you. Mm -hmm. Whether you're the bride, whether whether you're just walking down the street and you want to feel like your best self, yes. no matter what it is, it's you're you're in a unique piece. You're in a piece that speaks to you, mm -hmm. that comes to comes alive when it's on your body. Yep. And I feel like that's what vintage does. I always tell my clients that come in. That's like, just trust me, if, if it looks anything interesting to you on the hanger, just try it on. Because you have to try it on. Once it's on your body, that's when it really comes to life. Yes. And you can really see what the piece is supposed to look like. Yes. Hanger peel is one thing, on the body is something that's totally different. Yes, different. totally. Yeah. And then if you had to pick an era that you really love when it comes to the fashion, do yeah. you have a favorite? I do. I have two. Okay. So first, I, I, I love Art Deco. So anything in the from the 1920s Ooh, or 1930s. Yes. I happen to I have got married in the 1930s. by a cut down. So it, art, I'm, I'm really attracted to Deco pieces yes. in general. Um, although Deco pieces, of course, are 100 years or over now. They're harder to find. The you know they're very fragile. Right. So they're harder to bring into the store right. um, for functionality all the time. I do bring in as much as I can. But then on the other coast, I would yes. say 1970s yes. is the decade that I am so attracted to. I, I think it's just because of Studio 54 right. and all like the fun stories you get to hear about that time and like you get to see uh, you know amazing people beyond the jogger and you know these icons wearing diana ross you know wearing these amazing pieces so those silhouettes of like yeah. the slip dress i feel um, like the 70s too there was so there was such a wide like it was like super classic preppy 70s yes. it was very like suiting 70s it was yes Studio 54 glitz and glam like yes. there's so, so much many fun Ways to explore the '70s. So true. It's the fashion. I yeah. love it. Uh, it's, Annie Hall. I mean that. Exactly. That I, and that's yeah. why it's like the high waisted, mm -hmm. like wide leg trouser with the blazer, mm -hmm. and then like the slip dress, mm -hmm. and then like the sparkle. Halston, mm -hmm. you know, Halston is you know one of my top five you yeah. know designers. So you know, yeah, like you said, there's so much to it. So yeah. I would say those are like the two decades that I'm, I'm really. Um, attracted to. to yeah Ooh, yeah well yeah. I see it here in the store yeah. and I feel like we need to jump around the store and see everything that she has and we are talking holidays and holiday styling so I think what would be fun is I think I should just try on some of your fun I can dresses do. for the holidays so we're gonna go and kind of do like a dress tour and try on and then also maybe style up more ready to wear like a full holiday yeah. look yeah. and I just feel like if Wait there's time. any time to play dress up, holidays. it's the holiday season. Totally. You have the excuse. I don't care what. You have the reason to yes. dress up. There and nobody's going to say, like, why are you dressed up? Yeah. I mean, I don't think you should pay attention to that anyway. But Agreed. the holidays gives you permission. I right? Agree. Yeah. So and you good. have parties. You have gatherings. Dinners. You have your own fabulous yeah. self in your house. Just, so. just wanting to be fantastic. Yes. And I think you're right. It's, it's actually the best time it of the is. year to actually want to dress up. So Always play dress up December. <laughs>
trying on like the ultimate party dress. Yes. <laughs> yes. My dream come true. <laughs> I'm so happy you chose it. I feel like them. actually I would love to have like a moody bride moment in this. Like wouldn't that be amazing? It, it's amazing. And honestly, I do get yeah. brides in here who are like, I'm just going to wear black. Yeah. And I'm like, good for you. You know, like, it's a kind of cool like black veil yes. or something. Oh, oh my gosh. Moody gosh. Yes. So this is a 1970s Loris Azaro gown. Um, I mean, it's like, I'm almost speechless just like talking about it because it's just so insane. It's got layers. It's got about three layers of fabric underneath yeah. like this knit, like mesh, um, just to kind of give it the fullness of the skirt. And then all of this is actually chenille. Ooh, so yeah. they, it's chenille, um, like polka dots and then like the chevron striped bodice. Mm -hmm. And oh, then, yeah. as you can see, it's got like this layer of tulle underneath the shoulder just to really give it that big lift Drum. balloon sleeve um, look. Yes. And the cool thing about this gown is that you can wear it on the shoulders like you are, but you can also wear it yeah, one shoulder on. something which, here. Yeah, if you, you, know, you, you, that's when tailoring comes in and you yes, really kind of you bring it, it in. Fitted. But like if yeah. you wanted to wear it off the shoulder, you can. If you wanted to wear it on one shoulder, you can. Yeah. Or you can have it how you have it just and have it on both. So you can really wear it many different ways, which I always like the vintage and I always try to point these things out when I have clients here. Yeah. It's like the functionality of a piece. Yeah. How many different ways can you wear it? You know, yeah. because one event you might want to wear it one way and then you might want to switch it up and wear another. So you can actually like, have cost per wear, like yeah. really wear the piece more than just one time for one event. Yeah. So. And I feel like, you know what, just go out on a date night in this. Just go out I mean, and, and, and host a party at your house, host a little dinner yes. party, put it on. Yeah. And just, and just Merry wear Christmas, it and everybody. enjoy it. Yeah. <laughs> Christmas evening with everybody. Um, okay. I feel like let's put some little things to it, like maybe some amazing earrings okay. or something fun. Gorgeous. That's, That's a dress. Amazing. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. So whatever, whatever you, whatever, whatever you're thinking, whatever. Yeah, you're I definitely feel like we have to have a sequin moment. I'm okay. kind of liking this one. If this one will fit me. Which one? I feel the this black and white. Oh yeah, for sure. I feel well, like that would be. That one's amazing. I just got that one in. Actually, I haven't even seen it on yet. So let's do okay, it. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Yeah. I'm wearing like architecture on my body is what I feel like it is. It is. It's like, like it's so. so symmetrical. Yes. You know, like with all of the lines and this is the first time I'm seeing it on. So I'm like Ooh. also in awe right now because as I was saying, it's all about when you put things on yes. the body is when things really come to life. I mean, this, so this is an amazing dress. It's a silk chiffon with the beadwork all, you know, all beaded on top of the silk chiffon and all of the flowers, the ornamentation is their sequins. And you can see like the rhinestones right in, cent in, in the center of the flowers. I mean, the ornamentation is pretty amazing yeah. on this dress. I also love that it has a waist. I feel like sometimes be on yes. the sequin dress from the 80s sometimes. I don't know if the straight. 80s or, or straight. Yeah. And so you lose like your shape. So yeah. I like that it has a waist and then it goes down and it's that, it's not too long. It's not short. It's like that perfect like that angle, perfect flat, yeah. heel boot, whatever you, you want. You can wear whatever style. you want to wear yeah. with it. Yeah. Sorry, I just keep staring at it because it's... <laughs> <laughs> it's so much fun. It really is. Okay, let's dress it up. Let's finish it off. Let's frost it. Let's play. Let's do it. <laughs>
about it. So this is, you know, everything that I love, which is it's gold, silver, all metallics. Um, it's a Leonard um, from the 1980s. Again, I guess I'm having a little theme here. It's like I like yeah. I like the a good sleeve, and you're yeah. picking all these dresses with the, the big sleeves. So I do too. I'm noticing. I, I love a good. I sleeve. feel like I walk through a rack and I look for the sleeve. It's a drama. Yes, it's all it's about like drama. drama. Maybe love trauma. trauma. I yeah. love that. Yep. And it's different for Leonard because Leonard is really known for like their silk jerseys. Mm. And Leonard was also very well known like around the time of Pucci. Like they have very similar prints. Oh, okay. okay. So most people think of a Leonard and they think of like a Pucci ish kind of print as silk right. jersey. And this is so unique to him because it's this crazy metallic yeah. um, cocktail dress. It's so. Amazing. Yeah, and it's and nice back, it takes you I in at the waist. The real drama, and you see all these like amazing yes. pleats pleating around the around the waist. So I also it really gives like that fullness. The um, length is really fun and kind of different because yeah. sometimes with the '80s with dresses like this, they're to the floor, yeah, which feel then a little harder to wear. Yeah, but this feels it's more meaty. flirty, yeah. and fun and yeah. playful. And honestly, if you just put on little like sneakers, that would be so fun. It'd be so like, cute with this. Yeah, if you wanted to kind of have an extra day look. Yeah. yeah but but, you know, and that's the great thing about this length is like yeah. you can wear flats and yep. then you can wear Ooh. heels. So, yep. and, and like the sneaker idea would be great. It would look so nice. It would look really cool with this. It would. Yeah. I feel like I see like some like a bomber running, jacket, like a ball cap and sneakers yeah. running around fashion week or something like that. You know. I love how you style things. I love how the, your brain works with the styling. <laughs> it would be really fun. Yeah. Um, and then of course the holiday. Yeah. This is like the perfect holiday dress. Yeah. Oh. And then with your marabou shoes. <laughs> yeah. Now come on down here because we have to talk about these. Tell me about these. Your these are your creations. So we are making the kit vintage is making these shoes right Just now. Look at this. So they are yes, we even have our they're stamped and everything. They are made with a nice satin fabric and the marabou feathers, of course. And I'm glad you had noticed earlier that they're comfortable because that was a really, really important for me to make sure that when you're actually in the shoes that they feel like you're Walking like on smush. Kind of. I feel like I'm walking on clouds. <laughs> I want to wear these every day, and these are shoppable, right? These are shoppable. Yes, can shop these. Yes, exactly. Because I have multiple sizes of them. Whereas vintage, you want to get one. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I know, that's so fun. Yeah. Oh my gosh, and I just feel like you throw these on with everything as you're wearing and right now yes. with denim, and it, it looks so cute. Exactly, like great with denim, great with a dress, great with leather pants. I mean, yeah, whatever, whatever so you want to put on. Yeah, oh, with, with a robe, right? Um, I think we should finish off and frost this and zhuzh it a little bit for the Yay. holidays. Something like that? Yeah, I really, I You're think I love that. You're more into the stars. Okay, let's They feel like playful. final full always play dress up outfit moment and so we took a bunch of amazing separates from the kit vintage and just made the ultimate holiday gaudy gold goodness of an outfit so robin when you come in here <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just in awe because I, I love what she put together i love it so much I so love it. um tell me the details of everything i'm wearing so you've got you you literally piece together all these separates which look amazing so i guess we should just start with the their 1980s sequined sequin pants. pants. I don't even so know good. if there's like a certain label on it. I don't think it matters. They're just so great. Yep. Along with this issue, that's the label, silk. There are like pictures of like old, like Victorian, mm. Edwardian styled pics actually. Oh, on yeah. Them. Yeah, so like that so go into cool. your hair. Yes. And then you have an 80s Angaro, a bustier. Mm, and that's this. metallic, of course, because we're all about metallics yes. in the store and then i love this blazer it's like this quilted metallic elizabeth arden gold so blazer and it's just and it's light isn't it it's yes, like light as it air is. this blazer and it's quilted which quilting is so in right yes. now so it's like a fun mix of everything with the gold quilting yeah. blazer i have a saying called make it better with the blazer well, 
Totally. And it truly and it does. does. <laughs> everything does. It's, and this one, this laser, you can wear with everything. Yes. Yeah, so oh my gosh. gosh. Metallics totally. you can throw on with everything. Totally. And I, I just love, love the entire how you like piecemealed it all together and like it looks so, like it looks like it was like it, like in Sultan's store like that. You I know? love it. Yeah. I feel like I need some fabulous earrings and a bag to finish it off. Mm -hmm. So let's do that. watching you play dress up here. I love, this was like the ultimate dress up closet and getting to come in here and just like put everything on and twirl around in it. So thank you. Thank you. So much fun. And I feel like this was just like full holiday dressing party mode of putting together like all, all the separates. Yes, you can have your dress moment, but finding all the pieces that are like glitz and glam. And yeah, and putting, putting it together. Yeah. Putting it together to make your own style. Yeah. You know, putting it together to make your own look, to make you feel personalized. Yes. yes. So where can everybody find you, shop the kit, all of that, the details? You can find me in West Hollywood in Los Angeles if you are here local, or you can find us on Instagram, just at The Kit Vintage, or our website, thekitvintage.com. And you list some of the items on your website, right, that people can buy? Yes, okay. yes, you can definitely Great. buy pieces on the website. It's not all there, but right. there certainly is a lot. And you can always DM me through Instagram if you're looking for a certain or specific piece, I can always send photos separately. And if you want, if you're from out of town and you're coming into LA, you have to come to the Kit Vintage. Oh Put all these amazing pieces on your body if you have a wedding coming up or anything fun. I mean, or just in general. Just in, just in life. Just, just you know, want to have on. a great life piece. Yeah, it's a great <laughs> life every day. I love that. Um, I think that's it. So I'm just going to say, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel. I have new videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays. And finally, always, always play, play dress up. up. Bye. <laughs>